Today on the show, we're going to be talking about the secret that people with talent use all the time, and you can do it too. I'll show you. Come on. Hey everyone, welcome back. My name is Michelle R. Acker, and this is my show, Beeswax and Blowtorches. Today on the show, we're going to be talking about the secret behind talent. Talented people have a secret. Some of them talk about it, some of them don't. But I'm going to share the secret with you today, and I'm going to show you how you can use it. I'm going to paint while we chat. There's a little sneak peek. I've even created this bonus tool that I'm going to offer you at the end of the video for free to help you get started implementing this in your own life and growing your own talent. Come on, let's go. Welcome back inside my studio. What is the secret that people with talent use all the time? You're gonna maybe hate me when I tell you because it's really obvious and it's really simple. People with talent practice. They practice, they practice, they practice some more. Now before you tune out and click away and go watch something else, think about it. You know this, right? You know that they practice, you know that they hone their skills, but do you do that for yourself? Do you make yourself sit down and practice and hone the skills that you want to get better at? Whatever kind of art you're doing, are you a songwriter, are you a painter, are you a writer? Are you making yourself sit in that chair or get in your studio or go wherever it is that you create your art and practice? Are you making yourself do that? Because my guess is if you're here watching this video, you might be like me and your biggest hurdle might be that you are not routinely making yourself practice and get better at your craft whatever it might be. The secret is really simple. You've got to practice. And I bet you've tried to practice before. Same as I have. You've tried to build a routine. You've tried to get in the habit. And it takes a lot of intentional thought and effort to create new habits. That's why I'm going to help you at the end of this video by giving you a bonus tool that will help you build that habit into a daily routine where you are consistently practicing just five minutes a day is all I'm going to ask, but five minutes of practice on a consistent basis will really make a difference in your skills and your abilities and your confidence in your own talent. Every artist was first in amateur. Ralph Waldo Emerson. I love that because I think so often we compare our current talent with their expert level talent after hours and hours and years of practice. And that's not fair to anyone. So remember that, make a note of it. Every artist was first an amateur and they practiced and they practiced and they practiced some more. You need to do the same. So do I, we'll do it together. Maybe you're more than willing to practice, but you don't know where to start or you don't know how to go about doing it. There's a really helpful tool out there. It's called the internet. It's called YouTube. And it's this thing where you watch videos online and people teach you what they know. It's the craziest thing. Okay, you know I'm totally teasing you, right? But seriously, YouTube is the second largest search engine in the world and it's owned by the largest search engine in the world. You can find anything you wanna know on YouTube and learn it for free. So hopefully you have no excuse left and you know it's time to get ready and go practice but you need to create a routine to do it. So I'm offering you a free bonus tool. I'll tell you how to download it at the end of this video. And I'm going to walk you through a couple of quick questions that will help you create a consistent routine. I call it practice five, five, five. So five minutes, five days a week for five months. That's all we're going to do. I'm created a little worksheet for you. We've got little check boxes each day that you do your five minutes of practice, you cross off or fill in a little box, however you want to do it. Take a picture of something that you do on the first day and take a picture of something that you do on the last day and compare. I think you might be surprised. Also on this bonus tool, I'm going to walk you through a couple of quick questions that will get you focused on what are you practicing so that you're practicing in a consistent way. All right, are you ready to download your free bonus tool? If you will go to michelleacker.com slash perks, you will find a sign up link, put your email in and I will send you a direct link 
to download the Practice 555 bonus tool. So again, that's michelleacker.com slash perks. You'll be signed up for my email list. You'll automatically receive the bonus tool download once you subscribe. And of course, you don't have to stay subscribed. You can unsubscribe at any time, but hopefully you'll want to stick around. I'm not going to spam your inbox. I send out a newsletter once a month with some helpful tools, free downloads, and I often do giveaways too. So I hope you'll stick around and stay with us even after you download your bonus tool. But either way, go to michelleacker.com slash perks and download your practice 555 bonus tool. And make sure you come back next week. We're going to be talking how you can use art as a form of therapy. I'm going to show you a painting process I use to get my negative anger and frustration and hurt feelings and whatever I don't want to be toxic inside of me to get it out. So I pour that out into the artwork and I make something really ugly and nasty and then I cover it and turn it into something beautiful. So I want to show you that technique. Next week we're going to walk through it step by step. All right, I think that looks good. I think I'm finished with it. Here is the final result. Can you see it? Pretty happy with this one. So make sure you're subscribed on YouTube. If you're watching this on Facebook, hop on over to the YouTube channel, click subscribe there and click the little notification bell and it will pop up and let you know anytime I upload a new video. And now for my serious side. Don't make me do this. I don't think so. Why are you blinking at me? Mm, hate that. Not me. Is it an episode or is it a show? Make up your mind. <laughs> okay, people with talent use this trick all the time, blah, blah, blah. What are you trying to say? <laughs> no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm not going to show you how to paint. <laughs> Bye, guys. See you next Friday.